unlike a car, you don't have to worry about the police pulling you over. So, you know, you just focus on ski racing. You don't have to focus on everybody else. First time on skis, I guess I was probably around two years old. My grandpa, he had a little cabin up in Whistler and we would walk to the hill every day. I started taking it a lot more serious when I made BC Ski Team. I was 15 years old at the time. I mean, it, it was serious before. I had taken a lot of commitment, but that was kind of when I decided that, you know, this could be a career, this could be a job. To date, I have nine podiums, three World Cup wins, two in downhill, one in Super G at Lake Louise. You know, those are, those are my biggest achievements. Those are when, when you really learned something about yourself and how to compete at a high level day in and day out. And, you know, I'm excited to kind of get into that next chapter of my career. Friend and teammate, Mike Janik, uh, we run a four-day ski camp for kids that need help in their ski careers and we just decided that with all our connections that we really need to do more and uh, we brought this, this camp into play uh, five years ago now and we really just we go skiing around with them and show that it, it's not all you know hard work it's a lot of fun and games to be out there on the World Cup circuit. Golf I use as, as one of my hobbies, just it's such a great mental break from the realities of life. With skiing, you know, it's two minutes of a race, but you, you're tired, you're fatigued, you know, you spend a lot of strain on your mind and everything, and then you, you just get the freedom of just focusing on hitting a golf ball. You know, everybody has their role on the team, and I think that's what, what makes our team such a unique group. I mean, there's not a whole bunch of extroverts and there's not a whole bunch of introverts and we, we mesh very well and uh, you know I think my, my job on the team is maybe to lighten the mood a little bit every once in a while and it, it, it is a job but whatever I would do for a job I'd be having fun so the day this isn't fun it's not a, it's not going to be my job anymore. <laughs> Mentally, it, that's where you have to be the strongest in skiing. And you need to really want to go faster. You want, you need to, to to really believe in yourself more than anybody else believes in yourself. And every day is a, a new roadblock, and it's just kind of to battle through that. I was in Chamonix, uh, a couple hundreds off the lead at the time. Uh, just a couple whoops, and unfortunately broke my leg and, and blew my knee. And uh, it's not a question of if I'll be back or anything. It's just when I'm going to be 100% and, and motivated to, to be on the top of the podium and just trying to work my way through it. And every day is the same goal and it's to win and to go fast and as hard as you can. <laughs> <laughs>